Hello everyone, Gareth Davis here and welcome back to the channel. So today, as promised, um, what I'm going to be doing is talking about my challenge that I'm going to be doing this summer. So it is called Reggie's Respirator 65 and I'll tell you why. So Reggie, obviously because of my son, respirator because there's going to be a respirator involved and 65 to represent the 65 kilometers that I will be covering as well as the 65 pounds I will be carrying. So let's go into a bit more. So the location is the Brecon Beacons. I've been up there many a times and I've done the fan dance race twice uh, in 2015 and 2016, both winter editions. Hard as hell. Conditions were horrendous, um, but it's about a 15 mile route and I did it in four hours, both times. So I'm pretty happy with that. Um, if the weather hadn't been so bad, it probably would have come in a little sub four hours. But it's the Brecon Beacons, and you can never guarantee on the weather. Anyone who's been up there will know exactly what I mean. The route that I'm going to be doing is the Fan Dance route. So that's 15 miles um, there and back. Um, and I'll, so I think that's about four times altogether. My mass is terrible. Um, whilst carrying 65 pounds on the back, full combat order and I will be wearing a S10 respirator from what I used to use. Uh, I think they're called um, M50 now. Never used them, so I'm just gonna stick with what I know, and that's the S10. So a little bit about the S10. The S10 is 1980s, or the SAS, you'll recognize it from where the SAS used to use it. Um, so it's a bit weird, so when you wear it just standing here doing nothing, um, it's actually not that hard to breathe. However, as soon as you exert yourself, breathing becomes a lot harder um, and that's why this challenge is going to be so hard. But I have to make it hard because I have to pick, people have to take notice and I want people to appreciate that I'm going to be suffering up there, um, but people are obviously suffering uh, worse than myself, um, so that's why I'm doing it. Um, I'm one of those people is my son, so that's why we're doing it. The date, the date is going to be the 4th of June, so it's in the summer, so I'm hoping weather conditions will be okay, however, um, you can't guarantee it. And with the health and safety side of things, um, regarding my, the respirator, so for food and drink, I will take the respirator off, um, just to consume calories and fluids. Um, and then resume the mask straight away. And then should the temperatures exceed, you know, a ridiculous uh, point, then obviously I think, you know, we'll, we'll call it on the day. I will have medical professionals working with me on the day and I will have support runners uh, working with me on the day. Um, so I'm not gonna be totally alone. And I'm aiming to do it um, in under 24 hours. So that is the goal. If I haven't finished it in 24 hours, it's an index and we will cut it at 24 hours um, because again you're just pushing into that realm of where things can go wrong and Reggie <laughs> needs me so it kind of defeats the point. So yeah, so that's the big challenge, Reggie's respirator 65. Um, I, what I will do is leave a link to my Instagram uh, in the comments below and then you can see smaller videos of my progress uh, leading up to uh, the big day. Um, but what I will do next week, um, I will record myself out doing some uh, tabbing work and um, show you, uh, yeah, hopefully I can get up to the beacons next week anyway. Um, but yeah, we'll go from there, okay? Thanks for all the support, guys. Uh, remember, like and subscribe, and uh, I will see you next week.